This video tutorial is part of the Scanix tutorial series by Pix Imaging. This chapter focuses on scanning sheet documents, like forms, invoices, receipts or cards. It is the first part of a two-part segment. To scan sheet documents, ensure sheet mode is selected. After proper adjustments as described in the last segment, simply place the document and click the scan button or tap on the space bar. Click on the thumbnail to enter edit mode for viewing, editing, or saving. To return to preview mode, click on the preview button. Notice that there is a translucent blue bar here at the top of the display. Any data or details of a document may get washed out or faded if it enters this region. Therefore always position the document outside of this forbidden area. The size of this area can be varied by tilting the stand or laptop screen. The word normal here indicates that it is ready to scan documents with more commonly found non-glossy paper. When scanning glossy documents like brochures or magazines, you may see a red patch here called the gloss warning. That means the scanned data at this region would be washed out due to the glossy nature of the document. Scanex has a unique feature to solve this. Simply tilt the stand or laptop screen downwards until this region changes color from blue to orange. However, do not tilt the stand or laptop screen too much. This will result in scans with very poor resolution or blurred. As long as the glossy document is outside the orange region, the details and data within the document shall remain intact and clear. Note that the scan result you see here is an actual capture from ScanX and recorded in real time. It is not a simulation. For illustration, on the left is a scan done by ScanX and the image on the right is taken by a conventional phone camera under the same environment. The white spot is created by the camera's flash and those yellow patches are due to the room's ceiling lights. ScanX has unique technologies to remove up to 95% of ambient light disturbances and totally eliminate flash effects. For the first time, you are able to obtain proper scans of glossy documents without the use of bulky conventional scanners. Now there are two methods to initiate scan, manual and automatic. When in manual scan mode, the letter M will be highlighted on the auto manual toggle button here. To switch to automatic scan mode, click on the button and the highlighted letter will toggle from M to A. Promptly place the document to be scanned and remove your hand immediately after placing the document. Scan will be initiated automatically once a document is placed and when no further motion is detected. The document is captured once a flash of light is observed, and the next document to be scanned can be placed without waiting for the last document to be processed. If you have documents of different sizes, you may want to place them one on top of the other, starting with the smallest one, as shown here.
you may start viewing or editing your previous scans without waiting for the last document to be processed. To return to manual scan mode, just click on the same auto manual toggle button again. Sometimes we encounter documents which are uneven or folded. To scan these documents, simply spread the document using your fingers like this. It is recommended that the index finger and thumb of each hand be used. Do not place fingers too deep into the document. Too close to document details. Or too slanted like this. After finding good positioning for your fingers, tap the keyboard spacebar to initiate scanning. After a laser red dot appears on the document, Swiftly reposition your fingers on the document before capture. Another way to do this is to switch to automatic scan mode. After automatic mode is selected, Place and spread out the document as before. Ensure that constant motion is applied until the document is properly positioned and flattened. Keep still for a second or two until a flash of light is observed. You can then immediately proceed with the next document. Be sure to watch part 2 of this segment on scanning staple documents, folded receipts and business cards. Peaks